This video will focus on balance and equations for first grade with representing the equations with drawings. The video before showed manipulatives and now we're ready to draw it, okay? So once again, we're trying to find out if this is true or false. So three plus two equals five. Just like before, I would draw my equal sign. And then I'm gonna use line paper because that's gonna really help with some first graders that really maybe end up making, you know, some X's or some circles or different sizes and this will kind of help with that. So here I have three plus two equals five. So I'm gonna represent three. One, two, three, and I'm gonna add on two more. And then I'm gonna represent five over here, trying to keep my X's all in the same. And then I'm gonna look and I'm gonna say, is that true? Is this three plus two equal to five or the same as five? And that's true, yes it is. You can see I started at the same place, I ended at the same place. Now, what if I have six plus, I'm sorry, six equals four plus three? So I'm gonna come down here now, six equals four plus three. So I'm gonna represent six four, five, six, and then I'm going to add on four, and then I'm going to add on three more. And I can see that is false, that is not, six is not equal to or the same as four plus three because that six is not equal to seven, so that would be false. Next, we have two plus one equals two plus two. We want to determine if this, if these are equal or if they are the same. So, two plus one, I'm gonna put my equal sign. So I'm gonna two plus one, and I'm gonna represent two and two more. And that, you can see that is false. Two plus one, which is three, is not the same or equal to two plus two, which is four. Um, if some of your students are still struggling, or um, you may want to um, switch colors, like they could do red for the two, and then a yellow, and then red and yellow um, if you need that. But if they're okay and can do one color, then you can definitely stick with that. But that would be something that you could differentiate with. All right, we're going to step it up a bit. Four minus two equals three plus two. So I'm going to draw my equal sign. And four, so I'm going to represent four here. One, two, three, four, but I'm gonna get rid of two of those, okay? I marked them out. And then I'm gonna represent three, there's my three, plus two more. And you can see that that is not equal because I'm stopping here now and I go here. So two, uh, that equation of four minus two is not equal to three plus two. And then our last one, we've got three equals uh, I'm sorry, three plus what equals four plus one? We're trying to find the missing add-in, all right? So we're really gonna think about, I'm gonna go ahead and represent four plus one, okay? And then I'm gonna start off with my three, and I gotta think about what number am I gonna add to three so that it's the same as or equal to four plus one? So once again, they can use a different color. I'm just gonna use the same color here. I added one and I added two. So three plus two, to make that true, uh, would you have to put a two in to equal four plus one. 